Let's take a closer look at the compacting process. For the better you understand the mechanics of how PM parts are made, the better you will be able to take advantage of the benefits of this well-established manufacturing process. Typical compacting techniques use rigid dyes set into special mechanical or hydraulic presses. Tool sets are made of either hardened steel and or carbides. There is a dye body or, or mold. And for simple geometries, at least one upper and lower punch. And in some cases, one or more core rods which will produce the designed in holes if required. The dye receives a charge of blended powder. The fill ratio of loose powder is around two and a half to one. This is delivered to the cavity by a feeder shoe. The upper and lower punches compress the powder. The upper punch is withdrawn and the lower punch ejects the pressed compact. The feeder shoe or transfer mechanism takes the piece away from the dye cavity. Then the feeder shoe refills the cavity with another charge of powder and the cycle repeats automatically.